Hello, my name is Joshua Garay and welcome to the tip of the day. Today we're going to discuss what you need to submit an offer for an apartment that you like. I highly recommend if you're going to go to an open house or even before you begin your apartment search process that you figure out how you're going to finance the apartment. So if you're looking to take out a mortgage, you really need to be pre-approved for a mortgage in advance. You have to figure out, am I putting 10% down, 20% down, 30% down. Most buildings in Manhattan are between, if it's a condo, usually it's 90% financing. And if it's a co-op, you have to put down a minimum of 20 percent more often than not so you have to make sure that you're going to be approved for a loan before you even begin the search process otherwise I hate to say it you're sort of wasting your time so you have to make sure you're pre-approved for a mortgage the other thing you want to do is go through your financials and make sure that all your ratios are in place so one of the key ratios to look at especially if you're applying for a co-op is your income to debt ratio so you want your income to debt ratio to be around 27 20 eight, maybe 29 or so. This is the number that boards typically look for. So you want to make sure that you have your pre-qualification letter all ready to go in advance, your financial statement that has to be ready, and then you can go out and you can start looking. Again, I recommend, as I've stated in previous videos, you should have a buyer's broker that you're going around with to make sure that you have somebody that's guiding you in the right direction and can give you the best market advice for the properties and the neighborhood that you're looking at. So it's important to have all these documents in place so that when you go to an open house and you see something that you like, you're ready to move on it. Because in this market, in Manhattan and Brooklyn, you have to move forward very, very quickly or else you can lose the apartment. There's just so much competition, there's a lot of buyers, and you have to be ready to go, have everything ready to be submitted so that hopefully it can be accepted. You send out, a contract is sent out, you sign the contract and then you move forward toward obtaining your financing, getting the official bank commitment, and then you close on the property. If you have any further questions, I'd be happy to discuss and explain. Please feel free to reach out. Thank you very much.